All right, just got another package. All right, and inside we have <coughs> a few Ziploc bags that have LP bridge. That's I guess the back is in indeed. So. I'll tell you that this is high, so as you can see, I just got my hair cut, so it looks kind of messy, but oh well. Anyway, so what I'm going to do, I have this, my second guitar, uh, which has a problem that the G-string doesn't stay in tune, because the, the bridge has, uh, as you can see, this knob moves. So what I did was that I ordered from AliExpress a new bridge and I'm going to now install it so let's check it out. So I'm going to first just snip off the strings. Alright, so the strings are there. I think I am going to stick with the original screws because they seem to be very deep in there. So, so here's the old tailpiece. So let's compare it to the new one. A bit more shiny. So, put that in there. And let's take the old bridge off. So here's the old one. And here's the new one. Alright. And changing it is super easy. Let's see if I can just Alright, so basically I forgot to actually Check which way it is, but I think it is this way that the screws are on the inside. So we just put it in and it's fixed, and then we just replace the strings, and that's it. So let's fast forward this part. Strings are now off, as we can see. So, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to get a cloth and then I'm going to apply some red pour juice. So, let's see it. So there's just just mild amount of it in there and since this is oil based it shouldn't harm the guitar in any way. It will feel slippery at first and I actually see that there is some dirt in the frets so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to take an old toothbrush and then I'm going to go through all the frets. Alright, I'll go get some water in a cup so I can clean up the rest of the gunk because I can see that there is still some of it left, as you can see. This is just plain water. And, as we all know, the thing is that guitar wood usually doesn't really like water. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to dip this, this in the water, then I'm going to brush the fret, and then I'm going to wipe it off with the cloth. Alright. Then let's put on some new strings, so... And we got ourselves a properly working guitar. Yeah. 
Next, let's fine tune the shield. So lovely. And that is how you change the bridge and the tailpiece in a guitar. I hope you enjoyed this quick demonstration. If you have any questions or comments, please write them down in the comments below. And thank you for watching. I'll make music.